the orange a poem of indigo at last on about a huge orange the size of it made us all laugh i peeled it and shared it with robert and dave they got a quarter and i had a half the orange that made me so happy as the ordinary things often do <laughs> lately the walk in the park and the shopping this is peace and contentment the rest of the day was quite easy i have done all the jobs in my work list and i had some time over i love you and i'm glad that i exist this is one of my favorite poem not one of my this is the only one favorite poem of mine which just describes so much about self love and how to love yourself it gave me the perspective it just knocked me down into several pieces and just gave me a full flush perspective of this is this is this is love you and it taught me i let's face it i never been in love i never been in any romantic love or any kind of even platonic love i never i never loved anyone so much it never losing someone never gave me grief or anything but this poem and just i read it and i was like for a moment am i a narcissist for loving myself this much <sighs> lately i'm loving myself a lot like it, it it just it makes so much sense to exist in the world when you when you see yourself loving yourself it's just amazing it's it's amazing like you not you doesn't need any big things you never need anyone's attention you never needs people people to notice you or the, the no, anyone to notice you it just it just happens you, you you recognize yourself and you validate yourself god this is self love uh, this poem has given me a lot of perspective about self love and it made me bang just mm, dude this is what it is and this is this is where we are going from here and there is no zero coming and there are days and this poem has made me to realize there is no low days there is no long days when you love yourself because you know if you love yourself you know you know what is good what is bad and there will be a bad days but you never feel that much of like god i would i shouldn't have done that you never you will be like i'm glad that i'm going through this and i'm glad that i'm discovering that i'm loving myself more through this half full day that's how it always happened for me that's how it always done for my my sense and my ability to knock it off and to know how much i love myself there is no low points of loving myself there is always the high point i will never hit a low point while uh, you know facing some tragedy or some traumas and every single thing and it's always easy for me to forgive others because i knew i can i can i am loving myself and i never needed that person ever again in my life so it's easy for me to forgive them and i know how difficult it's to forgive people mm, there are a lot of harmful thing they might have done to you and you will come to come to an understanding and a compassion towards them and you doesn't you, you just want to forgive them because you just want to take the weight off from you and just throw it away that's it that's the level of uh, maturity you are having and you have to do it and uh, loving myself have taught me so much and this poem i'm glad oh god i'm glad that i i discovered this poem it just gave me so much perspective and it's it's too much dude and i i remember while reading this poem i was pulling my eyes out and just couldn't take it anymore and i realized how much i love myself and this poem have given a lot of perspective toward my sense and everything is i would say everything is happy but i would say i came to peace at last after discovering myself that i love myself so much you should also try it <laughs>